Kanye West sued for sexual harassment of his personal assistant. Um, <laughs> what do you think about this? I mean, because clearly he got this girl off OnlyFans just to sexually harass her. That was her. <laughs> that was her job was to get paid out to be sexually harassed by Kanye West, and maybe do you know answer some phones here and there. Um, I think he should have listened to his homeboy that just got caught on thirty four felonies. <laughs> Pay him. You got this kind of money, man. I mean, you have it like on your neck. The money she's asking for it. Give her a chain. Anything, man. Damn. Give Keep her that quiet. custom cyber truck you got. Anything. Was that his? That I think all so. glass car yeah, or whatever? Diamond, whatever. Yeah. I don't know. I think that was his. Yeah, I saw the I saw it pop up on social media, but you know, you can't trust everything yeah, you see anymore. Yeah. Yeah, but yay, stop playing. <clears throat> Give her credits to one of your songs or whatever, so she'll forever have a check and um, be done with it, man. You, come on, man. If they going after your homeboy, they they got your homeboy, they'll get your ass too. They'll get uh, you, you, man. You know that's not how Kanye rolls. Uh, this dude, he will come <laughs> out with a song, this and this bitch, and have to pay yeah. her twice. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, he, he he get off the meds or, you know, he get in his feelings or whatever yeah. and hit the stage and start dropping names, man. It's not going to look good for old boy. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> like, yeah, he's a little Like Jay little said, sensitive. I gave him 20 mil without even thinking. You gave me 20 minutes on stage. What were you thinking? You know? Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, uh, it's not good. Uh, bad for business. Uh, yeah, yeah. Just make it go away. Make it go away. Get back to the music and um, focus your focus. You know, get off these damn broads, man. I mean, this is these are this is the stuff that brings down empires. You know, it's always it's, it's always something behind. You know, always something behind some ass. Always something behind some ass, man. Uh-huh. Either dude end up beating somebody's ass and getting locked up or getting your ass beat or coming out of pocket because you didn't did some stupid shit like this, man. No, she's, she's claiming that, good. she's claiming that she was supposed to be paid a three million dollars severance and he Damn. never kicked it out. Damn. You know, like you okay. said, pay him. Yeah, just pay, pay him. him. It's it's cheaper, fam. Just pay him, man. I know I ain't got that kind of bread, but damn, I know you the, do. The way these scandals end up ruining everybody. Uh, yes. You know, there's, there's, I've always said this, man. You have one rule when you're dealing with working girls. Do not negotiate the price. It's going to fuck up your experience. <laughs> it really is. And how I came down to this, this, this thought of, it was years ago. I don't know if you remember this. Um, there was a Secret Service detail for one of the presidents went down to South America, you know, oh kind of uh, like spot, you know, yep. kind of, you know, just get a little bit of sight on, you know, yep. everything down there just before the president gets down there and they get some time off. They get a couple of working girls and these dudes, Secret Service making, you know, six figures go negotiate prices with a third world hooker yeah it's like how yeah. much could this woman possibly charge in central or south america that part and you're gonna and negotiate you're trying, a price you're trying to haggle you trying to haggle <laughs> like, and, and it's just like like if you start arguing about a price with a working girl and you're there to be pleasured how much pleasure do you think you're gonna get once you <laughs> strike a deal for what she's not asking for, you know, like your, her heart's not going to be in it. <laughs> <laughs> you, you know what I mean? Just, and if you showed up to work tomorrow, the motherfucker said, eh, you know, you know, normally you make $50 an hour. But for today, today, can we can we do 30? Yeah. Your work ain't going to get done, right? Yeah. Yeah. It's you slacking. You slacking. It's not. Like you and said, when you're in a pleasure game. <laughs> nah. She raking teeth. Like, it's it's not going to go down the way you want it to. You know? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I, didn't, didn't have that perspective. I appreciate that, man. You was like, man, once you start haggling, yeah, yeah man, it's, it's not. 
it's not going to be what you what you want it to be or what you need it to be at that time. So like, like you said, third world country, you want a presidential detail. You got a, you got some downtime, man. Utilize it to the fullest, man. Spend what you need to spend. It ain't going to be that much. Especially when this girl can just be like, you know what? Secret Service out here paying for hoes. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all come you down here I mean? and interview me, and I, you know, just give me a thousand dollars, and I give you the exclusive. That's it. Yeah, yeah. You fuck. And there's there's nothing against the the working girls in in other countries. Like the stigma associated with selling booty is only in America. Yes. So if yes. if these girls come out and say, hey, you know, I sold some bottom half, and he didn't want to pay, you know, there's everybody in her community is gonna be like, what you mean he didn't want to pay? Not that you're a fucking whore. You know, yeah. it's right. There's no right. backlash to the woman. Like, bro, pay her what she asks. Or just move <laughs> on. How right. do you not negotiate the price before you leave the club? <laughs> like, how do you, how do you get into the conversation? We're like, oh, we'll talk about it when we get back to the room. Won't you see no. this penis? <laughs> like, no. no, no, it doesn't work that way, bro. Yeah, I, I, oh. I I'm having flashbacks now of you know working security out here and dude got trick rolled because he paid her talk about uh, let me go into the you know the discount store or whatever I, I'm not the discount store but just the, the, the downstairs shop and I, I had to get some condoms he paid her in advance while he went to go get the condoms she dipped and he went and called security talk about she robbed me like, what did she take from you well I paid her and we was like continue what you pay her for Never mind. Never yeah, mind. You know that's illegal inside of the city limits. That part. You know, like, that bro, part. you can't call the police when you're committing a crime. <laughs> you dry snitching on yourself. <laughs> this is what tourists don't understand. And like you said, man, trying to not necessarily negotiate. You should know better. You, you paid her before the service? Yeah. And this you turned job. your back? Yeah, this you turned job. your back to about, wait right here while I go get condoms. Mm-hmm. Okay. Keep an eye on my wallet and my passport for me. I'll be right back. <laughs> you look trustworthy. Yeah. He said we had dudes get robbed and, you know, they took all his shit and was like, uh, do you want us to call your wife? You know, he has no ID, you know, but it, he has a room, but, it, you know, she took his wallet. So all his shit, his cash, credit cards, everything, he has nothing. All he has is you know, phone numbers from his coworkers because they they there on a business trip. So he got you know to get in touch with his people to get clothes, to get all this shit, and then he got to explain to his wife, you know, call home and like cancel the cards. Why? You see what Why I'm should I cancel the cards, honey? <laughs> right. What happened? <laughs> what were you doing? You there on business, right? What happened? You lost your whole wallet. It's not what I'm doing. It's what you ain't doing. <laughs> <laughs> This your fault, bitch. <laughs> you brought this money. on us. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah, just like, dog, I didn't even think about the whole, just, you know, depleting the whole situation, the whole experience. Just, you know, you, 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 you fucked up the whole experience by trying to negotiate. And now you, you're doing a, a, a Trump by just acting like, yeah, you know, I paid her. Everything is cool. No, yes. bro, it ain't cool. It is very obvious Trump is the father you never had. Wow. Do you remember when he said wow. that? Yeah. 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 Like yep. father, like son, bro. Father, like son. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> That's it. Get this clown out of here, man. He's, he's doing what Kanye do now. And it ain't good music. Unintended. <laughs> Fuck. Genius. <laughs> Genius. <laughs> Spell genius with a J. Go ahead. 